John Calvin once used an analogy of sailing in an old-time ship, well, a ship of his day. He says, seeing that a pilot steers the ship in which we sail, who will never allow us to perish, even in the midst of shipwrecks, there is no reason why our mind should be overwhelmed with fear and overcome with weariness. Some people will focus on the shipwrecks, and there have been shipwrecks, but others will realize that the pilot steering the ship of your life will never allow you to perish. Therefore, you should not be overwhelmed with fear or overcome with weariness. And that's a big thing, because many people that I pray with today are overcome with weariness. And I believe that comes from living too much within the human mind, instead of relying on the pilot that will always steer us straight. In Psalms 55, 22, it says, Cast your burden upon the Lord, and God will sustain you. God will never allow the righteous to be shaken. When you find yourself worried about the challenges of today or the uncertainties of tomorrow, ask yourself whether you're in the place of God, totally. If you're ready to place your concerns and your life in God's all-powerful, all-knowing, and all-loving hands, sometimes that takes a lot to do. Literally, we have to pry our grip off of the problem to let God take care of it. Now, if the answer to your question is yes, you can draw strength today from the source of strength that will never fail, your God in heaven. And even when trouble arrives at your door and threatens an extended stay, you can find comfort and courage in the certain knowledge that your Creator is keenly aware of your pain and that God is willing and able to heal your broken heart. So, when tough times come, depend on God. God is trustworthy now and forever.